and AMD. Okay? So, there's four different types of an acquired immunity. The first one is activate natural immunity. So we're going to go into more. Then you have your activate artificial immunity, too. Now, active natural immunity goes into natural exposures to antigens, which would be essentially, let's say, you catch a fever or a cold by naturally being exposed to your brother or your sister, who already has it, and that's how you catch it naturally exposed. Active artificial immunity has to do with exposures to antigens that aren't as natural. Um, they're artificially put in, like a shot. A shot is a good example. You are put you're given antigens. Is this making sense, Andrew? Hmm? What? Is this making sense to you? The whole active, active, passive, passive? Uh, maybe. Maybe? Here, can you tell me what active goes with? Uh, is it an antibody or is it uh, antigen? Yeah, antigen. The antigen, are you sure? Yeah, I don't really understand. You're not really getting it? No. Okay. Frustrated. What do you have on your notes? Let's see. Put uh, your right down. Lymphatic, good. Acquired immunity. Good. What is this? Uh, yeah. And you like to draw. That's that's <laughs> a good thing. But might be a good idea. Do you have a piece of paper? No. Yeah. Yeah. Somewhere there. Yeah. Grab a couple pieces of paper. We're going to look at this a little bit something, okay? Cornell note-taking system. Okay? It's pretty simple, and you're going to get it. So, the first thing is you need to make these lines on this paper. You want about two inches from the left side over. See like okay. this? And then you want about two from the bottom. So go ahead and make these lines on your paper. Okay, that's good. Now what you want to do is you, know, you need to know what these notes are for. Mm -hmm. So you're going to write the name of your class up here at the top, which this is AMP2. And then you want to write the date you're taking these notes over on the side. So now you can remember what happened in class that day. Mm. This is for your main notes. You will be copying off the board or whatever the teacher says. If you have any questions, you're going to be asking that over here on this side. Like... I'm a little confused with what an active natural immunity is. You can write that question down here and remember it. So you can address that question later with the teacher, a student, or even look it up in your book. Okay. Get it? Mm-hmm. Yeah, perfect. And then if the teacher dot, like draws any type of diagrams, um, that can be helpful for you too. You can put that over here as well. I like pictures. Yes, you can draw pictures that relate to class. Mm -hmm. So you're going to be putting your questions here, diagrams, drawings, whatever else, and, or any clues to help remember what you're studying. Okay. So, this is the Clinor Cornell system, and it's pretty easy to use. Um, you can use it in many different ways. The Cornell note-taking system, you put your notes here, you put your questions and diagrams at the side, and at the bottom you summarize what you learned. It's an easy and effective way of learning your material. 